What's going on YouTube? Welcome again to another edition of Toothpicks. Today we're going to be doing some fun. I'm going to be reviewing this bad boy right here, the Grill Gun by Grill Blazer. Stay tuned. We're going to have some fun. All right, guys, so look what we have here. We got the Grill Gun by Grill Blazer. They were so kind over there to send me an email and say, hey, we want to send you the Grill Gun. Can you look at it? Can you use it? Can you do a little review on it? So I want to do a review on it today, and I've been using it about a week and a half. There's really nothing to this, guys, but there are a couple features I want to go over that you really need to know. So first and foremost, you see the 16 ounce propane bottle. You can get this at any hardware store, any grocery store, as a matter of fact, and this can hook up to here just like that. And it goes into this little stand just so you can stand it up just like this. Or also with the kit, they sent me this hose. Now this hose hooks up to a 20 pound propane bottle or any connection that has this right here on the end and you can use more propane as far as if you need it. Now I can't think of why you would need that but say if you're going to compete or something and you don't want to run out of these little bottles and you just want to keep it hooked up and you got a lot of stuff to light then yeah hook up the big propane bottle and that'll work right there. Some other features of this gun right here is you got this depressing trigger right here and this is kind of like a little safety feature you know if you want to release the rest of the gases in this gun you can and the reason I'm saying that because if you to turn this gun upside down or on its side while you got the flame lit it automatically goes off for a safety um, a safety measure and if you wanted to take it off you just untwist this bottle right here and then you press the flame um, the little flame trigger right here and it'll take all the air out that way it's no gas left in the gun and of course you got your trigger you got your flow regulation valve right here to cut on your gas to the nozzle to the barrel and then you got the long barrel now they do have another version of this it's called the sous vide um, grill gun now I don't have that one but that was more for your searing your steaks and things like that and that'd be awesome to use right there but I'm pretty sure you can use this for that also so let's go ahead and we get this thing lit up I'm going to show you how, how we do this. So you want to keep your gun level, right? You don't want this to the side or nothing. And if you so happen to actually do that, like I said, unscrew the bottle, press on this trigger back here, and it releases the gas, and you can screw it back in. So what I want to do first, I want to go ahead and turn on this gas. So I'm going to turn it to the left. Now, you hear that? I don't want to turn it on all the way, just a little bit to start. And I want to press the trigger. There it is, right there. Now, you see the flame. If I turn it up, even a bigger flame, right? Now let's go over here. We're gonna try to light this. I got the real fire pit over here, and I got some wood in there. Let's see how well it lights this. See how long it takes. Now that's some good seasoned wood. That's one thing you should know that you should have starting out get that going now this is 4,000 BTU guys so this shouldn't take long at all if I had some wetter wood it probably would take a little longer let's see how long it goes and that flame lit I got a little wind today I can turn it up if I want now this is a smokeless fire pit so this fire pit right here it'll keep it you know once it gets started it'll get real hot and it'll keep it from smoking. I hear the crackling already. And sometimes on wood, you want to keep this lit for a while. All right, so there it is right there. That should be good. Now I'm gonna turn this off, right? And that's gonna light up a little bit. Now it might take a couple times to light it, depending on how wet your wood is, if it just rained. But it's gonna start, and it's pretty much heated up right there. If I wanted to hit it again, just turn it back on, hit the trigger. There it go, turn it on a little bit. 
and just turn it on. Now, now also, I got the bottom trigger. If I press on it, it'll give me a little more torch. See that? A little more gas. You want to keep this at a safe distance that you want to get this propane bottle hot? Even from this distance, look at this. Look at the distance I'm in. It's still throwing out flame. That's crazy. Now, I assume when you turn that off, right? Now, like I said, it's got a safety feature. Now, the, now the, now the propane bottle is off, okay? So what I would do is unscrew this, okay? And then I want to hit on this trigger and let all the gas out. Make sure it's off. There it is. And then now, you can put this back on. And you can, like, so it's called the grill gun for a reason, guys. You can use this with lighting your charcoals. And what I did over there, I lit my charcoals earlier right there. We're going to be putting some steaks on. And these light charcoal within a minute or less, guys, depending on how your flame is. That's a good thing I love about this. I'm not going to be using any of those little other lighters. It's going to be a waste of time. Guys, you got to get your hands on this. This is the Grill Gun by Grill Blazer. Hey, we're going to have some fun. I'm going to put this back in here. Maybe I should just go ahead light this cigar with it. I don't know. Wife thinks I'm crazy, Bob. You know what? Let's see. Let's go ahead and light it up. Nah, I'm just kidding. That's dangerous. I don't want you. I don't want to do that. If I did, probably burn up my whole cigar. Go ahead and get my cigar lit for today. Use my other little lighter. There you go. Right there. And then. And there it is, guys. Grill Blazer. Grill Gun by Grill Blazer. We're going to enjoy a beer. We're going to cook some steaks today. Stay tuned for another video in the future. Toothpicks. Don't forget hit that like button. Subscribe. And hit that instant notification bell. Help me out. Till next time, enjoy.